Hi there, today we're going to be creating some name creatures. So for today's lesson, you're gonna need a pencil. Um, you're gonna need something like a marker that has a flat top, because we're actually gonna use this cap um, to transfer a pencil, not necessarily for coloring right now, uh, probably an eraser. And then a little later for coloring, you can do crayon, markers, color pencils, whatever you've got to color in. Um, so first thing you're gonna do is start off with your paper and we're gonna fold this hot dog so it's nice and skinny. Okay, and then we're gonna open it up and I'm gonna have you turn it one way. Now this one you might need a little bit of help. Um, some of you, I, I know you know your name in cursive and others of you don't. So this is a good way to practice your name in cursive. So my first name, I go by Shelly, but um, my real name is Michelle. So I'm gonna write Michelle and I'm just gonna do it on this top half and I need to make sure that my letters are dropping down to that middle that middle space. Okay, so I'm gonna write my name. Okay, and some of us have some really long names, so we want to make sure that we're spacing that right. And I'm going to go over my letters because I want to make sure that I've got plenty of pencil here. This next part won't work too well if um, we have really thin pencil lines. So I'm going to go back over everything. And then once I've got this done, I'm gonna fold this to the inside. Oops, I got a space there. Okay, almost done. All right, so now I have my name on here and I'm gonna put my pencil side down on top of the blank side and I'm just going to use the cap of this marker and I've used some different things um, to, to do this. You could use um, the handle part of some scissors um, or if you if you're at home you could probably use like a edge of a spoon or something. That'd be kind of fun to just kind of try different things and see which one does it better. So I'm gonna rub for a little bit and then we're gonna open it up and see kind of what we've got. Okay, and you can see that it's starting to transfer over. Okay, I'm gonna Pause this and come back when I've got this all rubbed over. Okay, now that you've got your name transferred to both sides, I don't know if you can see that very well, but um, I'm gonna go ahead and start tracing out both sides of my name. I'm gonna do that with Sharpie. So you can kind of see that a little bit better. And then I'm gonna start thinking about how um, I'm going to make this into a creature. So I'm gonna go ahead and fast forward this little part.
All right, I've got my little alien um, or monster completed. Um, I may have a few more little details I wanna add in just a little bit later, but I've got a good start on it. So now I'm gonna go ahead and use my color pencils and start getting some color on here. And we'll check back here in just a little bit. All right, I just wrapped up my little monster here, and I think it looks pretty cute. Um, of course, I could always add in a little background, but um, I totally changed it. It's hard to really even see the, the Michelle in there now, but um, it sure um, is a good way to uh, make you think outside the box and um, come up with some creative ways to create your creature.